want to talk to y'all about the Facebook deception and how, and why and why you should not get caught up in Facebook. I'm not saying you shouldn't use it or anything, but I don't think you should get caught up in it. I think if anything, it's more of a problem than a solution. I feel like um, a lot of people think they know you on social media because of what they heard from somebody else or because of what you post or whatever and they don't even know you at all even if they hear something from somebody whether it's true or not the fact of the matter is the effect of social media this is the effect that it has you know what I mean a motherfucker could say something about you and everybody believe it So it's not about whether it's true or not. It's all about the effect that it can have on a person. Or, or not a person, but the, the it's all about the effect that social media has. Like by somebody saying something about you. Or you'll have uh, people who, have, who think they know every damn thing. They have all the answers on social media, but in real life, they don't have no answers for their real life. And the only reason why they continue to think that they are right or no shit on social media is because of people liking their shit they don't realize that just because somebody likes your shit doesn't mean you was right some people like your shit just so you like their shit or just because they fuck with you you know to help you keep a, a status or whatever but people let the likes go to their head and and Contrarily, they think that they know every damn thing and abandon their real life situations, not realizing that damn, I really don't know this much about much as I think. Because if I did, then I'd have my life together. And I'm not saying that just because somebody has money that it means that uh, I'm not saying just because somebody has money or that, that it means that they are uh, smarter than the next person or anything. But in a way, it kind of does because nobody's running around here saying, I just want to be broke on purpose. A lot of people are broke or in the situations they're in because of the choices they make. Choices you make speak volume about your characteristics. And uh, the choices you make say a lot about who you are. So, yeah, in a way, it does. If you got felonies and you can't get a job, a good job, that was a choice you made. This is like a chessboard. Life is like a chessboard. So, yeah, it matters. Everything matters. You can't just scratch that off and say a person made it in life because just because they go to work every day. It's deeper than that. They had to get themselves in that position. Unless we're talking about some kids that are born rich. Then maybe, yeah, I'll give you that. But other than that, people had to, you know make the right moves to get in the position they're in man but you know you got social media telling everybody they're right so they're always going to think they're right you also got social media telling all these women that they better than what they are so they're going to treat most men like shit or or you know what i mean they're going to think they're better than you even if you are on a higher way higher level than her she's going to think that she's better than you she's going to think you're better than you She's going to think she's better than you. And, and we all know that since women require way more than men, ain't no fucking way that they're really better than us. Than men, should I say, because I know women are listening too. How can you be better than men when you require more? That automatically puts men makes men more valuable. If women didn't require as much as they do, then that'd be a different story. But that's not the case, you know what I mean? But yeah, that social media even got these women thinking that they God and all this other shit. It's just, it's the devil really, people. And it distracts you from, you know, focusing on your purpose and doing shit you need to do in your life, man. You can say it don't. You can say, ah, it's no harm, no foul. I'm just on here for a second. But all that time adds up over time. Think about all that time over time. It all adds up. If you looked at how much time you spent doing there, you'd be amazed, for real. You also, it's also a problem about like drama. 
you be happy in a good mood and then a motherfucker don't like something you say and start arguing and shit, you know what I mean? It's just dumb, man. And if you're not careful, it, it could cause a lot of problems in your life, man. A lot of people, a lot of females on there or men on there aren't who they really are. So if you try to date people, look for people on there, you're setting yourself up for failure. You know what I mean? So yeah, man, I don't really have nothing else more to say about this shit, man. But um, it's definitely an illusional world. It has a lot of people who really aren't doing good in real life. They go on social media to feel like they're somebody. Because in real life, they they know they're really not. So this social media is an escape goat. That's another problem that it is to the whole society, uh, civilization. Because now people aren't reaching their full potential anymore. You know, all they got to do is get on the social media and feel like they're superstars and celebrities and shit. You know? This is real shit, man. Shit, if your so if your uh, real life don't match your social media, you got work to do. Obviously, you desire the shit because you wouldn't be fronting it. So now you gotta fucking make that shit happen, and it's never gonna happen. Always hopping on social media, looking for validation from motherfuckers, because that's exactly what it is. Motherfuckers looking for validation and praise. That's all it's about. And if you're not praising or validating them, they not fuck with your page or give a fuck about what you say. You could say the realest shit in the, ever said, and it don't matter. Or you could say the dumbest shit ever said, and everybody will click like if, if you validate them and shit. Or if they know you or some bullshit like that. Fake shit, man. You know, uh, like, get in a relationship, watch what happened to that damn social... Watch what happened. Nobody be fucking with you. You know what I mean? So it's just a booty call website and shit, man. But yeah, I'm out this motherfucker.